Welcome back to Infigyan my dear friends. Today in this video we are going to take up one very interesting and challenging system of equations. Equations are x square root x plus y square root y equal to 33 and square root x plus square root y equal to 3. We have to find out real solutions only. So I can begin this video by writing x should be greater than 0, y should be greater than 0 or x plus y should be always positive. Now I will solve this question in two different ways. So let me write here method number one and here I will focus on equation number two only. And I will consider squaring and cubing of this equation. Squaring and then I will consider cubing of the equation number two. Let us consider, I will write here root x plus root y equal to 3. Consider squaring, squaring. Now for cubing, I will be writing root x plus root y whole cube equal to 3 cube. Now I will use one substitution before I go into the expansion. It is square root x y equal to suppose a it is our substitution okay let us consider squaring first so i will write square root x whole square x plus y plus two times root x y equal to nine as per substitution i can write x plus y plus two a equal to nine or x plus y equal to 9 minus 2a. This equation I will call equation number 3. Now come to cubing part. a plus b whole cube identity. It is a cube plus b cube plus 3ab a plus b. So let us write a cube plus b cube plus 3ab a plus b. And right hand side 3 cube is 27. Now root x cube. Root x times root x times root x. So x root x. Root y cube. Y root y. 3 root x y. So I will write 3 a. Root x plus root y. Equation number 2 it is. So I will write 3. Equal to 27. So I can write from here our equation number. 4 basically which is x root x plus y root y equal to 27 minus 9a. This is our equation number 4. Now I will perform operation equation 3 into equation 4. Let us multiply both the equations. So I will write equation 3 times equation 4. So I will be writing x plus y times x root x plus y root y. And right hand side I will be writing 9 minus 2a times 27 minus 9a. Let us take the product one by one. Okay. I will multiply x with x root x. So I can write x square root x. Done. Now y times y root y. So I can write here y square root y. Now cross multiplication x with y root y. So I can write x y root y. And y with x root x. So it will be x y root x. Left hand side is done. Now right hand side. If I will multiply literally or better is to consider 2a minus 9. Take minus common from both the brackets. So it would be unchanged. Okay. Now x square root x plus y square root x. Check equation number 1. So I will be writing from here. It is 33. Done. Now from here I will be taking xy common. So let us take xy common. So 33 plus xy common 
in bracket it would be left root y plus root x and right hand side if i will multiply this 2a times 9a 18a square 2a times minus 27 so minus 54a minus 9 times 9a minus 81a minus 9 times minus 27 so it would be plus 243 now root x plus root y it is our equation number 2 so i can write equation as 33 plus 3xy equal to 18a square minus 54 plus 81 means minus if we will take common then it would be 54 plus 81 inside the bracket so i can write here 135 so minus 135a plus 243 now let us put the value of xy here as root xy is equal to a so i will be writing here xy as a square so our ultimate equation becomes 33 plus 3a square equal to 18a square minus 135a plus 243 so if you will rearrange the terms or take all the term to one side this equation will convert into 15a square minus 135a plus 210 equal to 0 equation is divisible by 15 so we will divide so ultimately quadratic will convert into a square minus 9a plus 14 equal to 0 remember a was our substitution root xy let's solve this quadratic a square minus 9a plus 14 equal to 0 let us use factorization factors of 14 7 times 2 so i can split middle term as minus 7a minus 2a take a common so a minus 7 minus 2 common a minus 7 equal to 0 a minus 7 overall common equal to 0 so a equal to 2 and 7 what was a let me write here a was a square root x y okay now if a is equal to 2 and 7 then we can write here a square root x y equal to 2 and 7 so x y will be squaring this equation so 4 and 49 now i will write our equation number 3 equation was x plus y let me write here x plus y equal to 9 minus 2a this was our equation 3 so i will write here x plus y 9 minus 2a so let's find out x plus y equal to 9 minus 2a so once a equal to 2 then i will be writing 9 minus 4 2 times 2 and once a equal to 7 then i will be writing 9 minus 2 times 7 is 14 so x plus y we can write it would be 5 and negative 5 x is positive y is positive x plus y must be positive so we will reject this solution it won't be accepted so which set of solution we will take up that is x plus y equal to 5 and x y equal to 4 because this minus 5 is coming from x y equal to 49 so our new system of equation is x plus y equal to 5 and x y equal to 4 we have to solve this you can see sum of roots product of roots i can frame immediately one equation or quadratic equation so let me write here x square minus sum of roots 5x product of roots 4 equal to 0 so once you will factorize this equation you will have x minus 1 x minus 4 factors of 4 so you can see it is minus 4x minus 1x minus 5x and plus 4 
सो आवर एक्स वैल्यू इज वन एंड फोर रिमेंबर समेशन ऑफ एक्स एंड वाई इज फाइव सो आई कैन राइट पैरली वाई वैल्यू ऑल्सो सो इफ एक्स इज वन वाई विल बी फोर इफ एक्स इज फोर वाई विल बी वन सो दिस इज अवर सोल्यूशन अल्टीमेट सोल्यूशन सो आई विल राइट हेयर एक्स कॉमा वाई इट वुड बी वन कॉमा फोर एंड फोर कॉमा वन नाउ लेट एस सी मैथड नंबर टू मैथड नंबर टू इज द मैथड ऑफ पासकल ट्रैंगल एंड द मैथड ऑफ बायनोमियल एक्सपेंशन सो आई विल कंसिडर स्ट्रेट अवे सब्सटीट्यूशन रूट एक्स इज इक्वल टू ए एंड रूट वाई इक्वल टू बी सो आई कैन राइट अवर इक्वेशन वन एंड टू सी इट विल चेंज सो रूट एक्स प्लस रूट वाई हेयर वी कैन राइट इट इज ए प्लस बी इक्वल टू थ्री Now what about equation number one? It would be x square. Let me write here. X square will be a power four, and y square will be b power four. So I can change our equations. Let me write here both the equations once. I will write a power four times a plus b power four times b equal to thirty three. And second equation is a plus b equal to three. Rewrite this equation. Equations are a power five plus b power five equal to thirty three. A plus b equal to three. So straight away you can see binomial expansion and Pascal triangle is about to come. So if I will begin with Pascal triangle. So let us write all the coefficients for power five, one three three one for power three, one four six four one for power four, and y one five ten ten five one will be the coefficients for our expansion power five. So I will write a plus b whole power five expansion now. But before that, if we can simplify two values, a square plus b square. And we can simplify a q plus b q. Then it would be better. So a plus b whole a square. I will write a square plus b square plus twice a b. Now a plus b is three. So left hand side will be nine. Right hand side is a square plus b square plus twice a b. Or we can write our required expression a square plus b square. This value will come out nine minus two a b. We will straight away use this result in our expansion. Now let us consider cube also. So a plus b whole cube. This value I will write first formula a cube plus b cube plus three a b a plus b. So I can write a plus b as three. So three cube twenty seven straight away. A cube plus B cube, three AB as it is, A plus B is three. So from here our result is A cube plus B cube. This value is equal to twenty-seven minus nine AB. Now let us use our expansion A plus B whole power five. So I will write A plus B whole power five expansion. Remember our Pascal triangle coefficients are one five ten ten five one. Okay, let us write a power five. I am clubbing these two coefficients all together. Then I will club five and five. Then I will consider ten and ten coefficient common. Okay, let us write one is common, so a power five plus b power five. Now consider five. So I will be writing a four b plus a b par four. Done. Now ten. I will write a q b square plus a square b q. Okay. Now I will substitute the values which we calculated so far. A plus b equal to it was three. So three par five equal to a par five plus b par five. It was our equation number 
3 which we substitute after substitution this value was there so this value is 33 plus 5 we will take a b common from here so i can write in the bracket a q plus b q here i will take a square b square common from the bracket so inside the bracket it is a plus b now a q plus b q this value we calculated it was 3 times 9 minus 3 a b so let us put all the values 3 power 5 this value is 243 33 plus 5 a b here i will be writing in the bracket 9 minus 3 a b and 3 was also there so 3 plus 10 a square b square a plus b is 3 once you will simplify this equation i am writing directly what result we will be having equation will come out quadratic in a b so a square b square minus 9 a b and then plus 14 equal to 0 so we can see factors are 7 and 2 so we can split our central term in the similar manner we have solved in method 1 so i can write straight away factors so it is coming out a b equal to a b minus 1 let me write here so factors are a b minus 2 times a b minus 7 so we can find out a b equal to 2 and 7 and our equation was the summation equation was a b equal to 3 so i can frame again two system of equation a plus b equal to 3 a b equal to 2 this is one set or one system and second system from here a plus b equal to 3 a b equal to 7 so let's solve both we'll find out our result so let me consider the first one a plus b equal to 3 a b equal to 2 and second system if i will write here a plus b equal to 3 a b equal to 7 so again sum of roots product of roots sum of roots product of roots so we can frame one quadratic equation in a let me write here a square minus sum of roots so 3a plus product of roots 2 equal to 0 now i can factor from here i will be writing a minus 1 a minus 2 equal to 0 so result will be a equal to 1 and a equal to 2 now what was a this was our substitution a this was our substitution b so i can write our x value will be a square so let me write here x is equal to a square so i will write it is 1 and 4 so if i will find out y so i can put anywhere i can write in the equation number 3 also and here also a equal to 1 b equal to 2 so we can write b will be equal to put this value here a1 then b will be 2 if b2 then a will be 1 so y is equal to b square so i will be writing 2 square is 4 1 square is 1 so conclusion is x comma y we can write it is 1 comma 4 this set or this set so 1 comma 4 or 4 comma 1 now come to equation or system of equation 2 i will frame again one quadratic equation in a sum of roots product of roots minus 3a plus product of root 7 equal to 0 let me check discriminant only b square minus 4ac so better is to write this value otherwise this b and b will clash so i will write here minus 3 square it is b square minus 4ac so 4 times 1 times 7 9 minus 28 minus 19 as it is negative complex solution will generate so we will reject this so our ultimate and final solution is 1 4 and 4 1 as per method number 1 i hope this video will be meaningful to you do not forget to like share and subscribe friends bye bye till next video good luck and take care of yourself bye bye